Do I need to update my BIOS regularly? You know, in the past, the answer has always been, well, no, not unless you've got a problem. As it turns out, the times they are changing. There are a couple of reasons you might actually want to proactively keep an eye on whether or not your BIOS needs an update. Do I need to update my BIOS regularly? Your system BIOS is software, but updating regularly may not be appropriate. Updating it to fix a bug, of course, would be. I'm Leo Notenboom, and this is AskLeo.com. Question. I just updated, upgraded my computer this past February. New motherboard, CPU, RAM, etc. There are a couple of items from my older computer also. I like to keep my software, utilities, antivirus, and so on up to date, generally when a new update or version is issued. My question is this. Since my computer is fairly new and appears to be operating normally, is it necessary to update the BIOS, motherboard, chipsets, and so forth? My BIOS is at or less than six months old. I mean, I know that if it ain't broke, don't fix it, but I just want to be all right with either keeping what I've got or update it. It's an interesting question. Even more interesting is that the answer may be changing. We stress how important it is to keep your system software up to date with the latest updates and patches and the like. Even applications frequently self-check and notify you automatically when updates are available. But what about your BIOS? BIOS and UEFI. The BIOS, or Basic Input Output System, and in more recent computers, the UEFI, Unified Extensible Firmware Interface, is software that's hardwired into your computer. I'll refer to both as BIOS throughout this article. It's the software that runs when you first turn on your machine, the software that does the power on self-test, aka POST. And it's the software that knows how to find and load other software, like the operating system. The BIOS may also be used by the operating system as an interface to access the hardware on your machine. You've captured my opinion with respect to BIOS updates. If it ain't broke, don't fix it. But recent events have shown us that something may indeed be broke, and it's a BIOS update that would fix it. More on that in a minute. Updating your BIOS. Unlike your operating system or even your application software, the BIOS rarely represents a vulnerability to your system. In fact, BIOS bugs, while they do happen, are typically infrequent and of low impact. But they can happen. And if a fix for a problem you're experiencing is a BIOS update, I would update it. Note, however, the wording I used. If a fix for a problem you're experiencing. Unlike the rest of the software on your machine, I don't generally recommend updating BIOS just because there's a new one available. Only when you're experiencing a problem fixed by a BIOS update, or perhaps rebuilding a machine from scratch, would I proactively look for and install the latest updates. The risk of updating your BIOS. BIOS updates are kind of funny since they update the firmware on your motherboard. As such, there's a slight risk. If the update fails for any reason, you may not be able to reboot your machine. The machine may simply appear dead. Most modern motherboards now include a reset mechanism to restore a BIOS to some original default. Sometimes it's a small switch on the motherboard itself. Sometimes it's a jumper to temporarily connect to exposed connections. Sometimes it's something else. And sometimes it doesn't exist. There are still motherboards that cannot be reset. Sometimes it's due to age. Sometimes it's a specific security choice to avoid someone being able to take over a machine by replacing its BIOS. Recent threats. Unfortunately, your machine may indeed be experiencing a problem in the form of a security vulnerability, and you may not even be aware of it. A class of CPU architecture vulnerabilities, beginning with Spectre and Meltdown, represent a CPU level issue that for some machines is fixed or mitigated by an update to the BIOS. The only way you would know this is to check with your computer's manufacturer. Your computer will function normally even with this issue in place. If you have the opportunity, I would sign up for a notification mailing list from your computer's manufacturer. I don't think this is the last we'll hear about this type of vulnerability needing a BIOS update. Where BIOS updates come from. Updates to the BIOS of your computer should come only directly from that computer's manufacturer. News and information should be available from the manufacturer's support website.
If you've built your own computer, then go to the website of the manufacturer of that computer's motherboard. That's the canonical source for information about your computer and the proper source for any and all updates to that computer's BIOS. For links related to this article or leave a comment, visit askleo.com slash 3010. I'm Leo Notenboom. This is askleo.com. Thanks for watching.